What's going on everyone? It's Kamaya Films and welcome back for another video. Today I got three different Instagram promos that you guys can use for your music videos. I'm going to be providing three green screen templates. That way you guys could do this more consistently and a lot easier in the future. To download these templates, it's going to be in the description below this video. Alright, so there's three things that you guys need to create these promos. You're going to need your trailer, your three templates, and a couple photos or screenshots. Once you have all of this imported in your event browser, you're gonna wanna create a new project. Let's name the project IG Promo. Now for the video format, we're gonna make it square. For the resolution, we're gonna do 1080 by 1080. I'm gonna drag down one of these templates. Now on the template, you can see that there's a green screen and a blue screen. To get rid of these, we're gonna have to use a keyer. So let's open the effects panel and search for keyer. Let's drag and drop the keyer onto the template. Now that we put the keyer onto the template, you can see that the blue has disappeared. Now we could grab one of the screenshots or the photos that we have and drag it underneath the template. Okay, now let's zoom into our image a little bit and adjust it to where we want it. Okay, the next step is to get rid of the green. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna combine the template layer with our photo. To do that, we're going to select both of them, right click, and hit New Compound Clip. It doesn't matter what you name it. Let's hit OK. Now that we have our compound clip, to get rid of the green, we're going to drag and drop the keyer onto it again. Now that the green's gone, we could drag our trailer underneath the template now. Let's get rid of the extra. And let's adjust the position of the video so it fills in this box right here. So let's just bring it down. We could zoom out a little bit. Right about there. And now when we play it, this is what we got. All we're missing now is the song title, the artist name, and the director's name. So let's do that now. Head over to the Titles and Generators panel and drag down a basic title. We're going to put song title artist name and official video now the font that I typically use for this is called Evanier Next Condensed so once we select that we're gonna make the song title and the artist name bold and keep the official video normal. Now let's make the text a little bit smaller and move the position up a little bit. So we need some space between the artist and the song title as well as the official video and the name. Let's put some spaces in there and then let's shrink down the font size for official video as well and then just bring up the baseline. All right, so that's looking good. So now for the director's name, we're going to duplicate what we already made here by holding the Alt button on the keyboard and dragging it down. Now we're going to bring the position of it underneath the video and then just change the text.
Instead of having it in bold, we're going to bring it back to regular font. And we're going to bring up the tracking. Let's bring down the font size a tad. And let's increase the tracking a little bit more. All right, and that's it. So to use the other templates, you just want to follow the same exact steps that we used in this tutorial. If you made it to the end of this video and it's helped you out, please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel for more content. If you want to see some insane trippy effects, click on this video here.